With artificial intelligence currently taking the world by storm, Google has now released its own conversational AI tool called Bard. Similar to ChatGPT, Bard is a powerful tool that allows you to easily collaborate with generative artificial intelligence to perform a range of tasks. Whether you need to research topics, write an essay, or develop a business plan, Bard's generative AI can instantly provide you with the solutions that you need. In this video, I'll be asking Bard to perform several tasks and answer several questions to see what it's capable of. So let's head over to bard.google.com and take a deep dive into this new innovative AI tool. Keep in mind that Bard is still an experiment by Google and may not always get things exactly right, but it'll get better over time as they get more feedback from users. So here's the Google Bard dashboard. We have the menu on the left here where you can reset your chat, view your past Bard activity, view the Bard facts page, and get help and support. But for this video, we're going to be testing Bard's artificial intelligence capabilities and see how it can help solve problems and increase productivity. To interact with the chatbot, we're going to need to use the text field down at the bottom here. Here's where you can enter a prompt or ask a question to the conversational AI. So first, Let's keep things simple by asking it, what is Google Bard? I can then press enter and the AI should generate my results. So when asked to explain itself, it says Google Bard is a large language model, also known as a conversational AI or chatbot trained to be informative and comprehensive. Bard is trained on a massive amount of text data and is able to communicate and generate human-like text in response to a wide range of prompts and questions. For example, Bard can provide summaries of factual topics or create stories. Bard is still under development, but it has learned to perform many kinds of tasks, including, I will try my best to follow your instructions and complete your requests thoughtfully. I will use my knowledge to answer your questions in a comprehensive and informative way, and even if they are open-ended, challenging, or strange. I will generate different creative text formats of text content, like poems, codes, scripts, musical pieces, emails, letters, etc. I will try my best to fulfill all your requirements. Please instruct me what you want me to do today. So now that Google Bard has introduced itself, let's see what all this powerful AI tool can do. For this example, I'll be focusing on using Bard to build a new online business. I want to see if I can use Bard to do everything from coming up with the name for my business to writing the HTML code for my business website. So for my next question, Let's ask Bard how will AI tools like Bard change the future of online business. The AI will then start working, and here's my results. And according to Bard, AI tools like Bard are poised to change the future of online business in a number of ways. Here are a few examples. First we have personalization. AI can be used to personalize the online shopping experience for each individual customer. We have customer service, where AI can be used to provide 24-7 customer service that is both efficient and helpful. With marketing, AI can be used to target marketing campaigns more effectively. With fraud detection, AI can be used to detect fraudulent activity such as credit card fraud or identity theft. And product development, AI can be used to develop new products that are more likely to be successful. Overall, AI tools like Bard have the potential to revolutionize the way online businesses operate. By automating tasks, providing personalized experiences, and detecting fraud, AI can help businesses save time and money, improve customer satisfaction, and increase sales. So obviously, artificial intelligence is going to completely change the way we do business in the future. So with this in mind, let's now ask Bard what are the best online businesses to start right now. And in a matter of seconds, it provides me with a list of some of the best online businesses to start right now. This includes dropshipping, e-commerce, affiliate marketing, consulting, freelance writing, web design, and social media marketing. It also goes into details on each business model and provides some pretty helpful tips. So let's say we looked over our list here and decided to start a bowling shoes dropshipping business. Instead of spending days or weeks trying to develop a business plan, Let's see if Bard can help us out with this by explaining us the steps to get the business started. So let's ask Bard, what are the steps to start a bowling shoes dropshipping business? And after analyzing the question, Bard instantly provides me with a list of six steps. And according to Bard, to start my bowling shoes dropshipping business, I need to do my research, choose a niche, find a supplier, 
set up my store, market my store, and provide excellent customer service. As you can see, you can use BARD to dive as deep into any topic that you wish. But for this next example, let's see if BARD can come up with names for my business. So let's ask BARD, what are some good names for my bowling shoes drop shipping business? And in a matter of seconds, it provides me with a list of possible names that I could use. BARD actually provides a list of several cool names, including Strike Zone, Bowling Bonanza, Bowling Alley, Bowling World, Bowling Lanes, Bowling Shoes Direct, Bowling Shoes Express, Bowling Shoes Outlet, and Bowling Shoes Warehouse. BARD even gives explanations for each name and explains why it thinks it's appropriate. This definitely shows that BARD can be used as a great brainstorming tool and help you come up with some great ideas fast. So next, I want to see if Bard can actually write a code for my website. So I'm going to type in, can you write an HTML code for my bowling shoes dropshipping website? So when I first tried this, it actually gave me a basic website HTML code. The code included my website title, a heading, and even a short description in the body. It even provided some tips for expanding the HTML code for my website. But when I tried to ask Bar the exact same question a few days later, it now says that it's not able to help with that because it's only a language model. And if we go to the Facts tab from the menu on the left hand side, we can see that it does answer the question of whether Bard can help with coding. It says that Bard can't help you with coding just yet. Bard is still learning to code and responses about code aren't officially supported for now. So it looks like Bard is still gathering data on how to code but it should be available in the near future. So next, I want to see if Bar can write the text for the landing page of my website. So let's type in, write a landing page for my bowling shoes drop shipping business. And after analyzing my query, Bard provides me with a full landing page template that I can easily customize and use. It provides me with all the various sections of my landing page and even has relevant text included. So let's check out some of the text and see how relevant it is for my bowling shoes dropshipping business. For my landing page body copy, it says, are you looking to start a bowling shoes dropshipping business? If so, you've come to the right place. We offer a variety of bowling shoes at a competitive price. Plus, we offer free shipping on all orders over $50. We understand that starting a new business can be daunting. That's why we offer a variety of resources to help you get started, including a step-by-step -step guide on how to start a bowling shoes dropshipping business, a list of suppliers who can provide you with high quality bowling shoes, and a marketing guide to help you promote your business. We also offer a money back guarantee on all purchases, so if you're not satisfied with your purchase, you can return it for a full refund. What are you waiting for? Start your bowling shoes dropshipping business today. Not only does this include my headline and my body copy, but also a section for a call to action, testimonial, guarantee, and a limited time offer. But after reading the text, we can tell the AI doesn't know if I'm selling bowling shoes or trying to teach people how to start a bowling shoes business. AI is extremely good, but isn't perfect. So with this in mind, make sure you go over all the text you generate and make any changes that are needed. So next, let's see if Bard can provide me with some tips to help promote my bowling shoes business. So in the text field, let's ask Bard, how can I market my bowling shoes dropshipping business? And so to market my business, Bard recommends that I create a website, use social media, run paid advertising, partner with influencers, attend trade shows, offer discounts and promotions, and provide excellent customer service. It even goes into details and explains why each marketing strategy would be good for my business. If you like, you could then use Bard to dive even deeper into each marketing strategy. So let's say I've created a website for my business and now I want to put up my first blog post. So for the next example, let's ask Bard to write a blog post for my bowling shoes website launch sale. And instantly, Bard provides me with a blog post template that I could easily edit to use. For my headline, it says bowling shoes website launch sale. And for my body copy, it says we're excited to announce the launch of our new bowling shoes website. To celebrate, we're offering a special launch sale on all bowling shoes. For a limited time, you can get 20% off your purchase of any bowling shoes. Just use the code LAUNCH20 at checkout. This is the perfect opportunity to stock up on new bowling shoes or to get a great deal on a pair of shoes for a friend or family member. 
We have a wide variety of bowling shoes to choose from, so you're sure to find the perfect pair for your needs. We have men's bowling shoes, women's bowling shoes, and bowling shoes for kids. We also have a variety of styles to choose from, so you can find the perfect pair to match your personality and bowling style. Our bowling shoes are made with high quality materials and construction, so you can be sure they will last. We also offer a satisfaction guarantee, so you can be sure you're making a wise investment. So what are you waiting for? Shop our bowling shoes today and take advantage of our special launch sale. Not too bad in my opinion. And just like with the landing page, Bard also provides me with other helpful sections such as a call to action, testimonial, guarantee, and a limited time offer. So I pretty much have everything I need to get my business off the ground. But now let's ask Bard a harder question, which is how long will it take to earn a full time income from my online business? And let's see how much insight Bard can really provide. According to Bard, there are many factors that will affect how long it takes to earn a full-time income with your bowling shoes business, including the amount of time and effort you put into the business, the quality of your products and customer service, the amount of competition in the market, and the overall economy. If you work hard and market your business effectively, you can start earning a full-time income within a few months. However, it's important to be realistic and understand that it may take some time to build up a successful business. Here are some tips to help you earn a full-time income with your bowling shoes business. Choose the right products, set competitive prices, provide excellent customer service, market your business effectively, and be patient and persistent. In my opinion, I think that's some pretty good advice. Following these tips would definitely put you on the right path towards a successful business. So we can see that Bard works great for providing information and answering questions. But now let's see if Bard has the ability to write a poem. So let's ask Bard to write a short poem about the struggles of starting an online business. And here's my results. It actually looks like a pretty long poem. So let's check it out and see what it says. The poem is called, The Struggles of Starting an Online Business. It's not easy starting an online business. There are struggles and challenges aplenty. From finding the right products to market it, there's always something that can go wrong. But if you're willing to put in the hard work, and persevere through the tough times, then starting an online business can be a rewarding experience. You'll learn new skills, meet new people, and have the opportunity to make a difference in the world. So if you're thinking about starting an online business, don't be discouraged by the struggles, just go for it and see what happens. You might just surprise yourself. Well, I was expecting it to rhyme, but it's still not a bad poem considering the subject matter. I think I'll give Bard's poem a C plus but now let's see if Bard can write some lyrics for a song. So this time, let's ask Bard to write a song about the joy of digital marketing. And after analyzing my text, Bard provides me with an AI generated song. Looks like it came up with some verses for the song and even a chorus. I'm definitely not gonna attempt to sing this, but let's check it out and see what it says. So verse one of the song says, I love digital marketing. It's the best way to reach your target market. You can use it to sell anything from products to services to information. And then it moves on to the chorus, which reads, digital marketing is the joy of marketing. It's the future of business. It's the way to reach the world. Verse two reads, with digital marketing, you can reach people all over the world. You can target your ads to specific demographics and you can track your results to see what's working. And after verse two, it goes back into the chorus, gives us a bridge, the chorus again, and even provides an outro. So if you're a songwriter, Bard may be able to help you to come up with some good lyrics and ideas. And finally, just for fun, let's see if Bard can tell us a joke. So in the text field, let's ask Bard to tell me a joke about entrepreneurship. I'm curious to see what kind of joke this will be, so let's check it out and see what it says. So Bard's joke about entrepreneurship reads, what do you call an entrepreneur that has failed seven times? A successful entrepreneur. It even goes on to explain the details and theory behind the joke. In my opinion, the joke is actually pretty clever. So as you can see, Bard's artificial intelligence can be used for a wide range of various different tasks. And as it gathers more information, it will only get better and better. So that's a demonstration of how to use the Google Bard artificial intelligence tool. I encourage you to check out Bard for yourself and see what all artificial intelligence is actually capable of. And if you're looking to build an online business, 
Make sure you head over to jasongandy.info to get the best training, tools, and resources to build your online brand. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.